What's up, y'all? It's your boy Heaven Hollywood back on IE Networks. This is the Heaven Hollywood Report, and let's get to it. Shout out to my sponsor in case you didn't know. That's ICYDK.blog. Make sure you check them out on all mobile devices and the world wide web. Before we get started, please make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss one video. Let's go. And we are talking about the rendition of My Boo last night at the Super Bowl between Usher and Alicia Keys. The chemistry was everything. And people were criticizing Usher for his affection that he was showing on Alicia Keys, saying, oh, Alicia's a married woman. Why is Usher touching her like that? They just totally dis... Uh, they just totally disregarded the smile on her face. They totally disregarded that uh, they rehearsed that. <laughs> so let, let's take you back to it. Uh, she came on. She did um, a little rendition of if, if I Ain't Got You. And then her and Usher did their legendary classic, My Boo. And, you know... They were doing a little acting like they, you know, their song, acting out that song. That song is called My Boo. Right? Everyone say everyone knows that Alicia Keys is married to Swiss Beats. And everyone knows that Usher is married to whatever that chick's name is, Jennifer, or whatever. So online there was people making memes saying that uh Swiss Beats should check Usher. All oh, uh, Swiss beats to slack us. Oh, and then there's this, there's this meme going around saying, oh, when Alicia Keys gets home tonight. And then it came from some movie where the woman walked in the door and then she got smacked. I think Blair Underwood was, was the guy. Um, or maybe it wasn't Blair Underwood, but it's, it's a movie that's out. And then when the girl came home, the lady came home, she turned around, he smacked her. So they're sitting there advocating for, you know, I know they told, oh, it's just a joke. No, it's not, that's not a joke. Domestic violence isn't a joke. You don't want people to joke about domestic violence. So they're advocating saying that Swizz Beats should check Usher and should smack Alicia Keys. And if he smacks Alicia Keys, then they, he's justified. You people need therapy. You people are sick. You know, and if this is any Gen, if this is any Gen X saying this, y'all should be ashamed of yourself. Because Usher and Alicia Keys are professionals, okay? Professionals. It's no different from if you're married and you're in a movie with someone, and in that movie, they, you have a, that person playing your husband, or your wife, and you have a sex scene with them. That's, that's just what it is. You're not, you know, they know that you're not married to them in real life, but that's who plays your husband or wife in the movie. Usher and Alicia Keys, the song is called My Boo. Just because she's married, uh, Usher has to act different because she's married? No. No, it's, it's, it's a rendition. It, it's a, they're, they're performing. It's a performance. And you get all these immature people. Let me tell you what, what, what it is. Dudes that are saying, couldn't be me, and I was here. Y'all's nigga got, you just proven you are exposing yourself. That is the weak pipe game, Negroes, saying that. You, you really think that Swizz Beats can lose his wife of how many years they've been married? A decade now? So a marriage of a decade, is, is he's going to lose his wife of a decade for 45 seconds on the stage with Usher, when Usher does that to how many people? So if you can lose your woman, if you are in fear of losing your woman in 45 seconds, trust me, brother, you're not going to keep up very long. That, that's already, look, that means y'all already have issues. If, if your marriage can break up in 45 seconds from a, from a performance, then... You don't have your, your marriage is already in trouble. So they were asking for Swiss Beats to uh, oh check us and Swiss Beats responded. And here's what Swiss said. 
Swiss Beats says, y'all talking about the wrong damn thing. Y'all don't see that amazing dress covering the entire stadium? Tonight's performance was nothing but amazing with two amazing giants. Congrats, Usher, and my love, Alicia Keys. That song is a classic. We don't do negative vibes on this side. We make history. Go see Giants at, uh, and then I, I guess I said Brooklyn, whatever. That's what. That's a grown man response. That's a Gen X response. The last real N words, like I like I call us Gen X dudes. The last real, and people always wonder why women are trying to date older men and women are trying to date older men in in the Gen X generation, even the ones that don't got money. I see more women because they the last real N-words. We the last real ones that, that was created. Most of the ones that just born after Gen X is suckers. Now you got a couple of millennials that are close to being Gen X that they got a lot of Gen X value in them, like my nephew. You know what I mean? Women will mess with them because, you know, they got a lot of Gen But all these, most of these millennials, and especially these Gen Z dudes, don't know women want them. They too crazy. And, rea and those are mostly the men that are reacting. <laughs> those are the ones that go out and, you know, and kill a baby mama or kill a girl when they break up with her. And then go kill himself. Those are the type of dudes that are saying, oh, I, it could never be me. I'd have to put hands on Usher and stuff like that. Too insecure, too possessive, too jealous. Your pipe game, that means your pipe game's weak. And you must know it's weak. <laughs> I would have no issue whatsoever. And especially, I wouldn't even have issue if Usher pulled my girl out of the audience. Swizz Beat said, look at, look, look at his wife. Absolutely amazing. Oh, my God. Alicia Keith. She's back on my list. She's back in my top 10. And boom, just like that, Alicia Keith is back in my top 10. <laughs> she is beautiful. She dropped. You see when Alicia dropped like the... Uh, the, the the cape part of it and that dress shoot again great performance by Usher and Alicia Keys I had no problem with it and if Swizz Beats who is Alicia Keys husband don't have a problem with it we saw the other night um Stephen Hill shout out to him um married to Shantae Moore you saw Usher doing, you know, dancing and hugging on Shantae Moore, calling her baby, how you doing, holding her hand. And Shantae Moore's husband was acting, oh, you know what he did? He took the camera and filmed it because he knows that's going to be a memorable moment for his wife. But guess who gets to, to peel Shantae Moore's dress off when they get home? Not Usher, her husband. Guess who gets to peel off this red, sexy outfit that Alicia Keys had on? Swiss Beats. Not Usher. Shout out to Swiss Beats, man. Responding like a real man. Shout out to Swiss Beats. That's what the real N-words do. That's how we respond. We're not insecure over here. Ain't no insecurity. All you young dudes... And all you old, old uh, pissy tail millennials, y'all are insecure. You're not secure about yourself. You're not secure in your manhood. You're not secure that, you know, them screams that you be hearing your woman do at night, you're not sure if they real or not. Or she just screaming and moaning just so you can stop quicker. <laughs> Let me know down in the comments, man, what you thought about the Usher performance. And y'all need to stop. Advocate, you say you don't like domestic violence, but you're out there advocating for Swizz Beats to put his hands on Alicia Keys. He would never put his hands on Alicia Keys for that performance because Swizz Beats is not no Gen Z dude. Real dudes. 
That's how real dudes respond. Shout out to Swiss Beat. Shout out to Alicia Keys. Shout out to Usher. The performance was great. Let me know down below what you think. You think Usher crossed the line? Or is it all in just a performance? Let me know down in the comments. Your boy Heaven Hollywood for the IE Network.